Ah, the mighty 390 big block engine, a staple of the Ford Motor Company in the 1960s and 70s. Weighing in at nearly 600 pounds, what it might have lacked in horsepower in the quarter mile, it more than made up for in raw torque and reliability. It was a true workhorse, but nothing could have prepared me for what was to happen that afternoon. From the driver's seat and before actually seeing it in action, my first thought was, as stupid as it sounds, the front end of the car must be jumping off the axle. It wasn't until I had someone else open the hood and look at the engine while I was goosing the accelerator pedal that I learned exactly what the problem was. And so it went that I may very well have the only Ford LTD with more miles on the engine than on the entire car itself. And of those miles on the engine, more of them could very well be vertical than horizontal. See for yourself. And that, my friends, is a broken motor mount. Maybe I've lived a sheltered life, but I gotta say, I've never seen anything like that, or not that severe, shall I say. Had a broken motor mount on an 86 Buick Park Avenue, but it didn't torque quite like that. Unbelievable. 